Hi there. So for this part of the question then, we've got to use the newton raphson procedure to obtain a second approximation for alpha. So you should be familiar with this formula here. If not, do go back and check out my tutorials on the newton raphson method. So to save us time, we're lucky that they give us the initial value, which is x1, which is 4, and they give us the values for f of 4 and f dash of 4. Just jot them down again here. f of 4 then is 3.099, and f dash 4, that's the first differential of f of x, when we substitute x equals 4 in, is 16.67. So to get x2, all we do is set n here equal to 1. So x2 is going to be equal x1, the first approximation, minus f of 4, okay, all divided by f dash of 4. So substitute those values in, and you should find that your approximation for alpha takes on this sum here. And if you work that out, you find you get 3.8140 and so on, which rounded to three significant figures is 3.81 as requested. Okay?